Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to the fried and pickled beet. beet. <laughs> so, what's up this week, Mila? Portobello pizzas, Steve. Mmm, mushrooms. <laughs> So, so where's the crust? The mushroom is the crust, Steve. That's the beauty of it. So, I thought we'd make them kind of Greek style. All right. We're gonna start by hollowing them out. Basically cut it sort of at an angle, getting most of the flesh out. We can chop up the flesh later and use it. Really, make a donut? No, 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 oh. no donuts. Oh, okay. Says. I like donuts. Wow, look at that. So we wanna oil them up a bit. I'll do one. Okay. Watch carefully. We're gonna pour the oil in, probably, you know, be generous like that. Then take your hand and you're gonna basically rub it through the inside and outside. And then we're gonna pop it in this beautiful cast iron pan. Some is good, more is better, right? Right. Pizza sauce, we take big spoon and we're gonna be again very generous here Steve I'll show you kind of like that we want them saucy that is a lot of sauce a little saucier a little saucier yeah I'm told I'm never quite saucy enough <laughs> we're basically gonna fill them with a ton of delicious Greek ingredients feta go generous you got to put on the uh, sun-dried tomatoes next. sun dried bell peppers we're gonna stop here for a second, Steve. Okay. We're gonna move into the herbs before we top the rest. Gotta have basil. Gotta have basil. I was gonna use oregano, but in my garden right now, fresh and beautiful, is marjoram, which is very similar to basil. It's just a little bit more mild. Definitely works. Maybe just use a bit more. Peel the leaves off here and chop it pretty fine. We can just okay. throw those all together, marjoram and basil. Divvy that up. All right. Olives or onions? Onions first. Onions, yeah. all right. These are like, Heaping pizzas. They're like works of art. Look yeah, aren't they beautiful? Let's just kind of compress it a little bit, Steve. Now what I like to do before I put on the cheese there is a bit more sauce, you know? The more sauce, the You can never better. be too saucy, that's what I hear. Yeah, that's that's the lesson of the day. And then lots of matzah. All right. Go for it. And kind of press it in, you know, kind of keep it mm. here. Is that a cooking term? Mm. <laughs> She can be saucy and I can be cheesy. <laughs> <laughs> you know what, we've got too much cheese here, but it's all going to basically melt into the bottom and be delicious. There we have it. 30 degrees outside. Perfect day to pop these in the oven for half an hour. Scorching 400 degrees. And in they go. Who knew mushrooms could look so good? Thanks for tuning in to the Fried and Pickled Beat, and we'll see you next time.